Dude, either this is a big fish, no, or it's oh, back gonna, in the weeds or something. I'm gonna clear mine, there's no way. Oh. Dude, oh my god. No way, dude. <laughs> Look at this thing. Oh, it's so heavy. That is absolutely ridiculous, dude. Dude, nice wallet. Holy Huge wallet, dude. Crap, dude. Oh, oh my Mega gosh, live, dude, dude. For the win. <laughs> this is our first time ever walleye fishing out here. Where to start, Mitchell? Where, Where to, to start? start? Well, today's a new day. That's that's a start. Gosh, your level of uh, enthusiasm. Today's a new day, Tom. I don't hey, want Tom, we're out here. Let's have some fun. It. I don't want it falsified. I want <laughs> real excitement. I'm excited, dude. You want me to bring it's, it to you? It's sunny out. You want me to it's bring gonna be it? like 95. Bring it. Let's go. I'm done. What is going on, guys? Today Woo! we're back with Woo! another video. It's me. We got Mitch with. We're out here today doing Mitchell. Well, what are we doing? You want me to walleyes. say it? I just We're asked on a new lake. We're going to catch some walleyes. We're and on... that's a plan. If it has walleyes, we don't even know. Well, we don't have walleyes. I think so, but Today we'll we catch them. We're on a new lake. Never been here. Well, I've been here like once musky fishing years yeah, ago. I've never this been here. This is like in my back life. when I was just a juvenile angler. Just a juvie. And uh, <laughs> we're on this lake today. Um, <laughs> breaking down some new water. And what we really want to do is come out, use some of the specifics in the Walleye Now app yep. to help put us on fish on a lake neither of us have ever. Mitch has never been out never here. Been I was out here. here once years ago. Definitely never walleye fished out. This is long before I ever walleye fished. But we're going to use the Walleye Now app, get on there, look at some of the recommended spots, and uh, break the lake down just like that. And that's kind of the plan. We want to take yep. you guys along for the ride as well. Now, Northern Wisconsin, Northern Minnesota, Northern Michigan, a lot of small lakes with kind of very vague or no information on them, which is exactly what we're walked into here right now. Yep. But um, this is a natural lake for sure. There's yep. no dam, there's nope. no inflow. Definitely natural lake. Um, yeah, the water looks like it's probably three, four feet visibility. Yeah, water temps about 69 degrees, so we're right in that early degrees. summer time frame. So we're right in this early summer time frame. So that's what we're going to do today. And it's definitely going to be a lot of driving around, whether that's documented or not, how well that's documented, unknown. But we're definitely going to be doing a lot of driving yeah. around, looking for fish. In a second here, we're going to get into the Walleye Now app, pick one of the spots recommended, and start looking at spots that fit that description yep. on this lake. Yep. All right, guys, so once we jump on the Walleye Now app here, what we want to do is obviously our first two selections, one's time of year, based off water temperature, and right now is early summer. So go ahead, click early summer. Second selection is what kind of lake we're on. Like we said, we're obviously on natural lake, so boom, natural lake. Now, the first thing we want to do, we don't want to jump right to presentations yet, because obviously we need to find fish before we can catch fish. So we got several locations here, mid-depth rock comps, deep weed edge, point extensions, and then we got a breakdown from a few different lakes, a Minnesota one, a North Dakota one, a South Dakota one, and a complete early summer guide, which has a ton of information is there as well. We're just gonna focus on these first three spots right now. Mid-depth rock comps, mid-depth weed, or deep weed edges, and point extensions. So once we watch these videos, like we already have, obviously I made them, it highlights the depth range in which we're kind of looking for fish at this time of year, which is kind of that 12 to 15, 17 foot zone. Yep. So next thing we can do is come to our hummingbird, set our mid-depth highlight to that zone, that 12 to 17 feet of water. Now, once you've done that, we start looking for these pieces of structure in those areas. The good tip, always start out by looking for the biggest piece of structure that fits this depth range. So what we're gonna do right now, we've actually already have one picked out. We are looking at a point that comes way out. And this is a this is kind of like a point extension. It kind of comes out at tier steps and goes down, and it's got some good water in that 12 to 17 foot zone. So the next thing we do is start driving around these areas and the walleye now app's great because once we start seeing stuff, whether that's an outside weed edge or fish on an outside weed edge, we can come back here and reference this and say, yep, that's exactly what those fish look like. So we can see that outside weed edge, we'll see the fish and we'll say, yep, okay, this is exactly what we're looking for this time of year. It breaks down all that information unbelievably well, whether that's a rock comp, an outside weed edge, a point extension, whatever it is, it's right here on the Walleye Now app. So we got a little bit of driving around to do on a couple spots that fit this same description. It looks like on this point extension, there is actually some rock and an outside weed edge, yep. but we're gonna cruise through a few more, look for fish. We'll show you what they look like when we find them and uh, start hopefully catching them after that. All right, spot number one did not have fish on it, but uh, the best part about the Walleye Now app is it's a great place to start. It gives you all the information where the most likely places are that walleyes are gonna be right now. So 
We just came off this first spot, nothing here. We're gonna go to a very similar looking spot, check it there and see what we see. Yeah, so, yeah. It's kind of scattered so far, huh? Yeah, one here, one there, a couple there. Might as well do an update. But we're used to that kind of fishing, aren't we? Yeah. All right, guys, so it looks like the predominant structure fish are using our weeds. Now, so far we're seeing screenshots of just like a fish here, a fish there. But we did come into one spot which is an outside weed edge, which we're coming up to here, an outside weed edge of kind of one of these predominant points in the lake. And the depth is spot on. I mean, it's pretty much 12, 14 feet, kind of where we're seeing some fish here. And once we come into it again here, I'll take a yeah, screenshot. Put the trolling on there. Just to be safe here. But we probably spent 45 minutes driving around, not a big lake, obviously. So, it, it, I mean, a big lake expect to do this for hours sometimes, but weeds do seem to be the key which has been the case in a lot of these places we've been fishing early summer now and i'm just kind of creeping into it got the spot where we think the fish are kind of right here and that weed edge hits at about 15 feet so i'm going to go ahead and take a screenshot for you guys now it's downwind of us so i'm just going to hit spy lock at the same time here and this is what we're looking for. Now, this is not like an impressive screenshot at all. It's just like a few fish so far. But like I said, we've only checked like three spots out here. And we're seeing, every time we get into weeds, we're seeing fish on that outside edge in about 13, 14 feet of water. Just like the walleye now app had suggested. This spot just looked like right at the tip of this, Mitchell, there's a little bit more of a concentration, huh? Yeah, looks like a, at least a few or maybe some more. Yeah, so now it's time to up. essentially start fishing for the fish. All right, guys, so now that we found some fish, the most important thing is we get back on the walleye now app, I go to the presentation slash lures. So same thing, we'll get in here, we'll hit early summer, we'll go to uh, Natural Lake, scroll below the locations, we got spinner rig and leech, slip bobber leech, aggressive snap jigging. Um, we got awesome on slip bobber in really shallow water, so that doesn't really apply to this situation. Um, we got a super shallow water spinner rig that we did in South Dakota, so that's not really applying to this specific situation. And we got how to rig a slip bobber and Ned rigging on there. So a bunch of great presentations that are custom catered that work extremely well at this time of year. Now, how are these fish set up? We got one decent pod right behind us and then scattering down the rest. So for right here, we want to fish a pinpointed presentation, which is perfect for something like a slip bobber slip on bobber. an outside weed edge like yep. this, like where it. we have a little pod of fish right behind us. So the Walleye Now app doesn't just tell you how to rig that presentation and how to rig a slip bobber. It tells you specifically like how far to be off the bottom, um, you know, what kind of bobber you want to be using, how to fish it, how to position your boat to fish the slip bobber, all those great things. So it's a massive tool when it comes to getting started, knowing exactly what presentation to use in specific locations. So we're going to rig up a couple slip bobbers with the jumbo leeches, start pitching on these fish, and uh, <laughs> there's, there's no idea what could really happen here. Yeah. I mean, there's definitely Who what knows? looks like walleyes behind us, but that's about as much as we got right now. This long, longer pull is so much better. I know, I like it. You're down. Down. Down, down, First down. First bobber down. I don't even know I got a lot of slack, I got a lot of slack. Drift. Oh, oh, dude. Is that dude. seriously what we think it is? Or is it in weeds? Dude, no, it's not in weeds. This feels like a good fish. There's no way, right? This is a good fish. Yeah, grab a net. <laughs> no way, Mitchell. I've been it's on too many wild goose chases to know. No, this is a good fish. Look at that. Dude, it is a walleye. Nice. <laughs> it is a walleye. Look at that. Oh, dude, that's a good fish. First one. That was a good one. That's a super nice one, dude, to start. Nice. Wow. Look nice. how gold they are, too. Beautiful. That's a big that's fish. That's incredible. That is incredible. And that was probably four minutes in yeah uh, first first pod of fish we even saw wow Ooh. pod number one of walleyes on the craft and mitchell sticks a nice one out of it on a slip bobber right away you need players or no yeah can you grab me players i got them hooked pretty good i can see we're looking back with the mega live at a weed edge and i can see fish back there yeah, but i can't tell what's a solid solid first fish here man hopefully we can find some more fish like this today what do you think real man Look at that thing. Seriously. Just a stud. Thick dude. Man, what a wow. stud. Well, like I was saying, I can see fish back there in the Mega Live, but there's so many like bluegills and there's big marks way up high, which I think are probably like bass back there, but there is like a couple of sizable marks kind of just outside of those stacks of fish that are likely the walleyes. I mean, we didn't see a lot on side imaging there, but no. it's kind of like this 
abrupt kind of weed edge hump deal. See, in those kind of situations, sometimes you just kind of got to fish. I mean, I saw like three fish in the side image when we pulled in here. I was like, let's just try it quick. I literally almost wanted to go back and buy that pay-per-view. To the fight? Yeah. Really? Mitchell, oh, you're down. Mitchell. You're down. I forget where my bobber even is, to be honest. How do I have so much slack out? I had a lot of slack too. It's pretty windy. Whoa. Dude, either this is a big fish. No. Or it's oh, back gonna, in the weeds or something. I'm gonna clear mine. There's no way. There's no way, right? I mean, no this. Way. Is it a musky? It's gotta be a musky, right? Nah, dude. I mean, you can tell they're big when the rods. Oh my gosh, dude. Dude, no way. It's a giant walleye, dude. It's a giant walleye. Oh, Look at this thing. Oh my gosh, dude. You're here, kidding come me. Come over here. Come over you're here. You're kidding me. Oh. Oh my gosh, dude. I have dude. not. Dude, this I is have not seen a fish that big in a long time. Oh my gosh. No okay, way. Okay, okay. Ready? Oh. Dude, oh my gosh. No way, dude. <laughs> Look at this thing. Oh, my, It's so heavy. That is absolutely ridiculous, dude. Oh it's been a while my since I caught gosh. one this heavy in northern Wisconsin. Oh my guys, gosh. Look at that thing. I cannot believe this. No way. <laughs> this is our first time ever walleye fishing out here. Oh my gosh. Now, either this is the flukiest thing with this big storm coming in. Look at the size of this thing's head, Mitchell. It's that thing's insane. It's huge. This is like a Green Bay walleye. It's, Look at that fish, dude. That thing is built. Mitchell, we need to take a th we need to take a thumbnail really All quick. Right. All right, here. Good. Yep, got it. You guys, look at oh this fish. I cannot believe this. Either we just stumbled into something crazy and this is like a fluke, or we just discovered, I don't know, a very cool tiny little lake. <laughs> I, I don't know, so. look at Man. that. Wow, dude, look at the head on that thing. That is incredible. That is the second fish match. We caught two, two tanks. really nice walleyes that so far. That thing's huge though. Grab that camera out of that thing. Wow, I'm almost shaking. Like that's a big fish. Going. Hold on, let me roll in. Yep. You guys, look at this walleye. Look at how crazy this is. Wow. Just, wow. Just a monster. Wow, dude. Oh my god. That's <laughs> fish number two. Oh my god. Fish number two <laughs> on a little tiny pod. But I mean, they're pretty much right where you think they should be this time of year. You know, it's got this wow. big piece of structure, it comes to a real tight point. Got some cabbage on it, a little bit of rock. I'm shocked. And they're sitting right there. This is insane. <laughs> I, mean, I feel like we could wrap the video. Right. Uh -huh. Now, a lot of you guys are probably watching this going, Tom, that walleye wasn't really that big. It was though. Well, <laughs> it was pretty good size. It was probably 27-ish inches long, but. Just a, so it's built. super thick. And you don't come to small, tiny lakes in Northern Wisconsin, Northern Minnesota, and uh, stumble out here and spot lock one time and anticipate that happening. Not far, I'm close, close to the boat. I'm an eternity oh. out there. Oh, it's down, it's down. Down? It's down. I'll leave mine drifting. Oh my gosh. On? Right at the boat, oh my, yeah. Could it be, are we striking lightning three dude, times? nice fish. For nice real? Fish. Nice fish here. Oh, damn dude, not as big, but. Dude, still a good fish, dude. <laughs> it's super good fish. This is wild, Your, your dude. bobber's like a mile out there. I was he right was at the right boat He was right next here. to the boat, huh? Yeah. Wow. There's just like one or two fish you could see right Like there. we're literally looking at the graph saying, hey, fish right there. Number three, dude. Dude, nice fish again. Too. I'm gonna wiggle this around, see if we can see more. Screwed my hook up, that's all with those first place. All right, here we go. Look at that, another solid, solid fish. Yeah, he's a solid 21 incher. Yeah, that's a good one. We did not, not didn't expect all. this at all. This is, a, this is a surprise, a good one at that. This is wild, dude. We have another lake we can fish. I'll see you later. And pretty much, you know, obviously we're filming, kind of using the Walleye Now app today. And we did a bunch of driving around and I just wasn't seeing where I like. Now this is just another one of those similar kinds of spots, but I did see fish on it. You know, some lakes, if they don't have a ton of walleyes in it, what you'll see is you might, you might drive three, four or five pieces of structure that fit those good characteristics this time of year and just not see fish. And the sixth one might have fish, where in a lake that's like, really high walleye densities, what you might see is they all, uh, you know, two thirds of those spots might have fish.
Fish? Yeah. Was, there, was a fish sitting on it? Obviously a bass. I don't know. This might be a walleye, dude. No way was this thing just sitting on it. Yeah, nice walleye. For real? Yeah. Oh my god. How was that even? He was possible? on there for a while, wasn't he? Oh my gosh, that's the most that's the craziest thing that's happened. It must have been set too deep, is probably what was going oh on. Oh my this is this a big fish again? What is this? Is it? I don't there's no way this is a walleye, right? I don't know. What man. is this? It hasn't jumped yet. Staying down. What is this, dude? It looked gold when it came by. It looked like a walleye. You, what? You, you might want to back off on the drag even, unless you think you're good. No, that's good. What is going on? That looks like a walleye to me, right? You might want to. This is ridiculous. We just kind of sat on the spot where we caught those three fish for a while. What? Look at this. Is Nothing it... happened. No way. And I just kind of let us drift back. I don't even have bait on. So that's it doesn't. Good. What? It, it doesn't look that big, but what is this, Tom? Is it a muskie? I don't know. Is yeah. it a muskie? It's got to be a muskie or pike, right? I don't know. It looked like a walleye to me, but I'm. It if it's a walleye, it's a giant. That is a little musky. Oh, a little musky. Okay. Musky on the leech. A little musky. Just sat there on it, too. I wonder if you like, ate a, picked the perch off it or something, you know? <laughs> I was right, gonna well, say. We got muskies, we got walleyes, we got say, large mouth. I was gonna say, if this is another giant walleye that's just running like that. Yeah, that was a ridiculous run. Insane. We got. Yeah. Big walleyes. We, we got, got big bass. We got Maybe now we got lunges. a little musky here. <laughs> oh man, what a sweet lake that we decided to come to today. It is very cool. All right, come on, bud. You're going back in. There you go. Wow, Mitchell, if this. No way. I saw him on the live, and I just dropped the bobber right down in front of him. No way. Is that a big walleye or bass? <laughs> okay. <laughs> what a spot though with the wind coming into these weeds, huh? Wow. It's just, it's literally loaded with everything. It's crazy. You guys probably saw that. I just kind of got done messing with Mitch's muskie and saw a fish right on top of the, right under, under the live. <laughs> Dropped right down to oh, him. What? He immediately bit. What's going on here? Buckets, son. Buckets. Good old bucket mouth. And I'm hoping to get, uh, you know, I can hit 20 pounds with my biggest five today, bring them into the scales. <laughs> and, uh, you know, cash a check on those fish today. Whoa, I'm way down. I'm way down? Oh my gosh, we're looking for... I broke my jig off. And... What is this? What do we have? Big Mitchell. Seriously, or are you just I'm playing with serious. Me feels I feel like every time we set like the hook, we're like, no way. What? I think it is. I think we're right. Oh, yeah, yeah, it's oh, a big yeah. walleye. Oh, another one. No, not as big. Oh, he's got me all handcuffed. Scoop, 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 scoop. <laughs> Look at that. Dude, it looks like a, a big muskie grabbed this fish, I think. Oh, Look at that. Man. Yeah, he did. A big muskie tried oh, to yeah. grab him. That's a big fish for a muskie to grab onto. All right, so. No way. We're not. We're still sitting on the same spot. Mitch caught the muskie, caught the walleyes, obviously. Same first spot here. Caught some bass. Caught a bunch of bass. And what we're seeing is obviously, you know, there's not 35 fish like this on this spot. Yeah, this fish 100% got muskalunge. Look at that tail. Look at the other side. You're all right with me now, girl. <laughs> right with me. But lucky to get away. Um, obviously, there's not just piles of these fish sitting here, so we're really using the the mega live, not just to see individual fish, but really fi figure out where this weed edge is. So we got going back this way. We got a lot of weeds. Going this way, I got a lot of weeds, and the tip of this thing is just right on bare going this way and there's no real rise anymore. So the tip of this, where the fish are most likely, it sits either like right here and then it kind of like, you can imagine it's like real tight right here and then it kind of wraps out like this. So I just keep putting my bobber right there over and over and over, hoping that fish are either coming from this way or coming from this way and coming to sit right on that tip of that point. Got him? Yep. Is it right? It feels right. Oh, Mitchell. I was or, actually just reviewing some footage. I, it's either a big bass it's gotta be. or it's a It's right, walleye. Mitchell. It's right. It's right. Please. The time is right. Mitchell stole my location. Oh, Mitchell, it is. Oh, dude. Nice fish again. Come on. Nice fish. Come on, Mitchell. 
Nice fit. Give it to me. <laughs> <laughs> nice. <laughs> Hopefully we got that Dude. on the front one. I know, Tom was losing. Hold them in the water, Mitch. So I'm gonna click it off just to make sure our audio is still good. Okay, look at that though. Just another absolute stud walleye right there. Man, having an absolute blast today. Mitchell, if there ever was a time. It's been ridiculous. It's been ridiculous today. If there ever was a time. Look at that thing. Let's go! Look at that thing. Man, it's just a Should tank. we get a dope little B-roll release? Sure. Yeah, I guess this is a let's go moment, huh? It is a let's go moment. <laughs> Tom's favorite saying, no. Oh, look at that crispiness. Oh! Get oh. some. Man. Get some or let's go? What are we doing? I like to say get let's some. Let's go get some. Let's go get some. This is getting some. too corny now. I don't like it. Oh, oh, that was oh, that's looking right. There we go. Oh, dude. No way. Give me some. No way. Give me some. There's no way no, we're going to pull another one off No here, way. Right? No way. What, this if it is, is, it's big, dude. It's real big, whatever it is. This is what my big one did. you see that did. bobber shoot down? I was literally trying to go to the bathroom once again. No way, dude. This is just like, gotta be a, another, is this another musky? It's big, whatever, dude. This could be. Dude. Just. What is going, I feel like I'm just. That's fine. No, I'm saying, I feel like I'm bringing in a brick right now. Well, it's definitely not a brick. <laughs> it's got to be a musky, right? It has to be, right? I don't know, man. Your big wall, I did the same stuff. Not this ridiculous, though, I don't think. Got to be a musky. Dude, it might be a walleye. Eh. What is it? What is it? Please, give me the good news. Give me the good news. No shot. It's a walleye. <laughs> wow. Oh, another good musky. <laughs> it's ridiculous, isn't it? I'm not even going to put him in the net. Grab him. I'll, I'll unhook him. I can unhook him. Take a little picture with him quick. We caught this fish, Mitchell. You don't care, but I still want to grab him. Oh, man, did he just f me up, dude. Dude, just... just oh, just, did he get me good. Just get the net on his head and I'll, I'll work on him. He'll be fine. Yeah, he got... Did you get sliced up really good? Oh, dude, yeah. Really? Yeah. There, I got him. How bad? Oh, pretty dude. bad. The little ones always get you the worst. The hook or what? No, his teeth. Oh, my thumb went right in his mouth. And the musky slime. We is... got tape or no? We don't, man. We don't. All right, here we go. <laughs> I got sliced. Tom got sliced up grabbing this thing. Little guy, another little musky. Second musky of the day for me. Look at that. It's telling me something, Tom. It's telling me I need to get out here and... Nice little yeah. 33, yeah. Yeah, nice little chunky guy. Nice colors, beautiful fish. He was not harmed at all, but Tom was. Yeah, well, you know, I put my thumb right in his mouth on accident. He just did the most perfect roll at the perfect time and got me. <laughs> all right, guys, I got one less sock, but still have all my digits. <laughs> you think I need stitches or no? You might, you might, you might need a few in there. Might be a stitches ordeal, but the you know, little guy got you pretty good. Probably just dunk her in some whiskey tonight, call it good. Tom said, I'm gonna shake you off, and he said, I don't think so, bud. Yeah. Better show some damn respect around here. <laughs> we missed him. You're down, you're down, you're down, right away, right oh. away. Nice. Gotta be right. Gotta it's be. Gotta be right, Mitchell. I, I think you're right. How's it feel? It feels Net? like a walleye. Ooh, ooh. Feels like a good walleye. All right, let me. Uh, it's gotta be. I think. Good so. walleye, Mitchell. Good walleye. Oh, We're nice. on. Spot number two. Oh, nice, nice. The guy's got a sock in his hand. Yeah. Ooh, nice fish. Nice fish, dude. Oh, nice fish. Watch yours, cause yours another, should go down right away. Another one. Yeah, I pitched it right out there. Yeah. There we go. Look at that, you guys. That was power slipping one right off the side imaging. I just told Mitch, I was like, man, those gotta be wallies right there. We actually pulled into the spot, the bow positioning was kind of wrong. Yeah. <laughs> I feel like a lot of times you get a new lake and you're like, oh, the wind's out of the south. And then you position on the spot and you're like, oh, wait a second, wind's out of the east <laughs> or something, you know? Yeah, we spotted the fish and just- And your angle's wrong. wrong. But kind of circled back on them right there, made one cast and you guys could see how absolutely immediate that was. That is what we're after, that's success. It feels good to do what we did on the first spot where we go in, bang, 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 catch some really nice fish. It's even more rewarding 
to go to another spot that's similar to that first spot, cast right on top of a pot of fish you see, and it all comes together. And that is courtesy of the walleye now app, following kind of those key steps of types of body water, exact locations where these fish can be found. And when we made all these videos, breaking it down, we have filmed them all right on location at that specific time of year. So it really is kind of the out of the gate building blocks to put you on fish quickly on these bodies of water, Absolutely. right Mitchell? Absolutely. And you guys are seeing it kind of in, in exactly progress. Exactly we made it. In work right here. Basically, just, so, there oh. we go. Oh, still rolling? Take them. Oh, it's success, Mitchell. Oh, feels like a good fish again, too. Dude, Tom. every single one's Dude. been quality. Seriously. Every single one's been quality. Seriously. That's looking big. Seriously. Man. And this is like back to back. Oh, yeah, nice wall. Nice fish. Oh, yeah, nice. Dude. Real nice fish. So, <laughs> such a pretty one, dude. Oh, Look how man. gold that Look fish is. Look how dark it is, dude. It Look looks how like gold a. gold that fish is. Yeah. Wow, that's so cool. What a nice fish, man. Seriously, how cool wow. is this color? Well, you guys, I don't really know a whole lot of what else to say because this has been just a wildly productive hour or so now. Yeah, it, honestly, it's probably the most fun I've had fishing in a long time, to be honest with you. The wind is insane, but you know we got this big front coming in. And as long as we can keep finding these fish and pitching to them, which I'm about to do again right now. Again, look at this. Look how cool and dark this fish is. Absolutely beautiful. Man, it's ridiculous out here today. So much fun. Let's get him back. Down, down, down. There we go. Wow, there we dude. Go. If that wasn't just solely <laughs> mega live, you know what I'm saying? It was 100%. We just cruised into a spot, Feels like and a I had the mega live down, and I was like, "There's two, there's two or three big fish Dude, way up off bottom." This is another good fish, too, Tom. Wow. This is a walleye. It's a stud. It feels like a stud. And uh, we cruised into this spot, anyways, and I was like, "Mitchell, there's three big ones up off bottom right there," and I drifted back into them. Fish you never would have seen with anything but nope. mega live. Uh, absolutely not. Kind of drifted backwards. We got another muskie on here. Is that what it is? A muskie sitting outside the weed bed. If we be, catch three muskies today, slip bobbing, this would be absolutely ridiculous. <laughs> I'm going back to the garage and I'm grabbing my muskie stuff and no put needs, ten son. In, putting ten Just in the boat leech. today. If this is the case, big walleye, dude. Nice walleye. Holy Huge crap, walleye, dude. dude. Oh, oh my mega gosh, live, dude. dude. For the win. Just a those stud fish were probably fish. eight feet off bottom or more yeah. and twenty feet of yeah. water. And we just sharpshooted them with the slip bobber oh my suspended gosh, in the water column. That thing is just that's another stud like we caught earlier. mega live right there. Look at that, that fish, dude. That is a giant, dude. dude. That's, that's <laughs> about as big as the first one. Yeah. The first really big one we caught. Oh, or Bobby. bigger, dude. Look at that thing. Grab them Insane. quick so it doesn't do too much flopping. I'm going to see if I can see another one, dude. That is unbelievable, isn't it? Unbelievable. I want to grab the bo bump board real fast, too, out of curiosity. 26, I'll bet. I think he's bigger than that. I think he's bigger than that. That first big one. It was about 26, 27. It was, it was over 27. Where is the bump board? Should be. Here's a classic situation of a couple dudes that never measure a fish. Oh, it's right there. Just have to out of curiosity. These things are so built that they just look bigger than what they probably 26 measure. 26 and a half. 26 and a half. Uh, 27. Is he? 27, yeah. Just a freaking tank. Look at that. Sharp shooting them off Mega Live, <laughs> new lake. Man, wow. look how built this fish is. This thing is a stud. Look how wide that thing is. Dude, look how fat this fish is. Man. On. <laughs> oh, he soaked the camera. Man. He wanted to get out of here. <laughs> soaked the camera. <laughs> well, That's we might awesome. not even be able to catch another fish here. I don't know, but that fish was, I just came in running sideways, keeping the live pointed sideways perpendicular to structure. Yep. And you know, looking on the side imaging, I just saw three big fish up off bottom on Mega Live. Whipped around quick, spot lock, cast it out, immediately Mitch went down. And even if we don't get another pot out of those fish, I mean, those are the hardest fish in the system to catch. Those fish that are way up off bottom that you just can't see them really with anything but something like Mega nope. Live. And they're just real roamy and nomadic around structure. But that was another stud. That was a stud. They're just so built, it's ridiculous. Oh, you're down, you're down, you're down. 
Nice. I just got back. You Literally know just my what this away. is. <laughs> you know. Oh, what here we go. This the guy's singing. What is this? The big one. We know what it is, son. And we have the guy singing. Nice fish. <laughs> nice fish. <laughs> oh, what a pattern we put together out here, huh? Yep. <laughs> Quality on. That's actually the smallest fish of the day. Yeah, which is just ridiculous because it's still so solid. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is definitely the smallest fish of the it day. It is. Wow, look at that. Pudgy as can be. Pendu jig just stuck right in the corner of his mouth. I got one thumb that doesn't really work right now. <laughs> I'll try to get him out here. You want me to unhook it for you? Oh, management. So the day you unhook my fish will be the day I quit fishing. Oh, jeez. <laughs> oh, man. Here we go. I got him out now. He just wants the jig. There we go. Beautiful walleyes. Big storm system coming in. New lake. Putting it together. I mean, this is kind of beyond putting it together. We're just kind of out here for sport now. You know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, now it's just for fun. It is fun. All right, guys, I literally do not know what else to say or what else to do. We're probably <laughs> gonna stay out here and do a little bit more exploring, but in order to not drag the video out too much, wanted to kind of wrap it up. Unbelievable day of fishing. Only we're really out here for probably four hours total today. Yeah, yeah, sure. And day. caught, you know, a, a crazy amount of big fish. Now, should you expect to go everywhere and see fish that big? No. no. Catching a bunch of 15 to 7 inches, 17 inches would have been an enormous win out here as well. We really had no idea coming in. Yeah. But the process that we go through to find fish on these bodies of water is broken down so unbelievably well on the Walleye Now app. I have spent basically my entire season so far this year, and my entire season last year, building this program, which is, you know, generally starts with the time of year you're fishing, then the body of water, then it goes into enormous detail. And what it's really meant to be is like a textbook guide where you're out fishing, maybe you're struggling, maybe it's on a lake you've never been to, you download the app, you hit let's go fishing, you select the time of year you're fishing, you select the body of water you're fishing, and you'll get detailed locations and several of them. The kind of the three or four or five best spots we look for fish at that time of year. Not just the location, but the actual GPS screenshot of the kind of spots we're looking for. Yeah. Then it takes a deep dive into the side imaging, down imaging sonar, the best kind of spots, what fish look like on that spot. So you can kind of cross-reference that with what you're seeing to the Walleye Now app to really get you on the straight and narrow to catching more fish as fast as it can possibly be done. And it's much more than relying on an old crummy fishing report that is so vague on details, it's ridiculous. But For sure. that's kind yeah. of uh, what we did there. And it obviously yeah. worked flawlessly today as it pointed us right in the direction to exactly what the Wally Now app said. We found fish on one of those pieces of structure. We ran that program with a presentation yep. that excels at this time of year with the specifics right on the Wally Now app. And the results were unbelievable today. So I don't yeah. know if Mitch has anything else to say because I just went on such a, a <laughs> rant right there. No, I mean, I just hopefully you guys can see the value in this, you know, all all this time all this effort that we're putting into this and we're continuing to build this you know it's going to get better as we go forward more information on there just more ways to catch fish but better organization. hopefully today it kind of shows you that there's tremendous value in what we're doing right now and you can come out to a lake like this you know like you said you don't expect to catch monster fish we did not expect to catch fish like this today at all but it's going to speed up the process for you it's going to help you out, especially if you're limited on time just there's so much value into this you just can't say that enough. and it's constantly added and it's all exclusive yep. to the walleye now app but i appreciate you guys watch this video me and mitch are going to bug out have a little fun this afternoon explore some more new water um and keep running this awesome pattern but i appreciate you guys watching this if you guys are not subscribed please go ahead and do that stay tuned for more content we'll see you guys next time